how the bear lost its tail. Once upon a time in a vast and dense forest, Bear had a long, lush tail that was the envy of all the other animals. He would strut around the forest, flaunting his tail and boasting about how it was the most splendid tail in all the land. One day, during a particularly harsh winter when food was scarce, Bear came across Fox, who was walking with a fish she had stolen. Where did you get the fish? asked Bear. Seeing an opportunity, sly and cunning, Fox hatched a plan. I went fishing, Mr. Bear, Fox replied. Eager to learn, Bear asked Fox to teach him how. Fox explained, The fish in the lake are not just delicious. They love beautiful tails. If you were to dip your magnificent tail in the water, they would come to admire it, and you could catch plenty of them. All you have to do is go out on the ice and dangle your long tail through the hole. You have to stay there for quite a long time. Don't worry if your tail burns a little. It means that the fish are taking the bait. The longer you stay, the more fish you'll get. Then you pull them up with one sharp tug. Driven by vanity and the promise of an easy meal, Bear hurried to the lake. It was covered with a thick layer of ice, but there was a small hole where he could dip his tail. Following Fox's instructions, Bear sat by the hole and dipped his tail into the icy water, waiting for the fish to come and admire it. Fox, meanwhile, slipped away, chuckling at her clever trick. Hours passed, and Bear sat patiently, dreaming of the fish that would soon be his. But no fish came. Instead, as the sun began to set, the temperature dropped even further, and Bear's tail, soaked and forgotten in the excitement, froze in the ice. When Bear finally stood to check on his magnificent catch, he found himself stuck. Just like Fox said, he pulled with one sharp tug, and his tail broke off, leaving just a stump. Bear roared in pain and anger, realising too late that he had been tricked by Fox. From that day on, bears have had short tails, and Bear learned a hard lesson about the dangers of vanity and the slyness of Fox.